back with another review. This time it's the Detour Protein Bar. Yes, we're going to review the Detour Protein Boost Bar. Arrgh. Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dan here from Specific Personal Training, helping you find alignment and success in health and fitness. So to stay up to date with more helpful review videos like this, workouts, and other great fitness related content, then be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to stay up to date with all the latest notifications from this channel. So we were walking around our local job lot the other day and saw these Detour Boost Protein Bars. And to be honest, Ocean State Job Lot is where we get most of our protein bars from. Um, that I've reviewed on this channel um, You can buy these other places, but uh, That's just where I tend to get my bars from and you know Ocean State They always have great deals and these protein bars were only a dollar each And you know most of this stock actually was only a dollar I think the most expensive ones we ever brought from there were the muscle farm combat bars um, And they were like two dollars, you know, so Anyway, what do I think of these bars? I have the caramel peanut version Detour Protein Boost, which has 20 grams of protein in, so um, automatically I like that. You know, I'm a protein fiend, especially when it comes to protein bars, so I'm always looking for the highest protein content, and if I can get it with the lowest carb content or the lowest fat content as well, that's also a winner. And so what are the nutritional stats on this? Well, I'll put them up on the screen here, but um, the stats are 8 grams of fat, 24 grams of carbs, um, with just 4 grams uh, of carbs of sugar per bar, and obviously 20 grams of protein. So you see, these are great for anyone on a carb or protein-based diet, as they are the highest macros with just a little bit of fat. Now, total calories are 230, so it's not really a meal replacement um, unless you were like a female on a 1500 calorie or lower diet. Um, but it's certainly a great snack to be carrying around post workout or on the go. So, what are the type of proteins that are in here? So, it's a protein blend which is a mix of whey concentrate, calcium concentrate. Um, which is otherwise known as casein powder. Uh, and further down the list of ingredients, you also have uh, a soya isolate too. Now, let's talk about what it tastes like before we go into the other stuff. Mm. What well, I do have to say, these do taste damn good. Uh, Melissa has tried them as well. And she thinks so too. Um, tell me so I think we're going to head back to the store to get and buy all the rest to be fair. Now, by the way, this is the caramel and peanut um, bar. And the chocolate on this is actually dark chocolate, which I am surprised at. First time I tried this, I'm surprised at. Is they didn't mention that on the packet and I thought it'd be a good selling point for them. However, I'm glad they didn't, didn't as I'm not a fan of dark chocolate. I'm not really a fan of chocolate generally. Oh my God! I actually like this and the dark chocolate with the peanuts and the caramel. Um, it tastes just like a Snickers. Snickers did a dark chocolate version. Um, well, at least that's what it reminded me of. Um, or a marathon bar for you Yanks. Um, uh, when I first had it, except for this has crisps in it, which Snickers doesn't. It has like rice crisps. Now, with that being said, yes, there are some flavorings and stuff that you would expect but not a whole lot and the thing that I love most about this is check this out if you can see that but it actually has real nuts in it no nut powder no nut flavorings or anything like that and a lot of soya there's quite a few soya products and bits in there um, but the bits that are on are non-gmo which again is great for us who are cautious about eating soya products as it's very badly mass produced by the world and this bar is actually also gluten free as well 
but yeah overall this is a very this is a very surprising taste for me and um, it has a great taste and if you see these online in your local store especially for a dollar then make sure you pick some of these bars up it has great macros great taste decent ingredients I did actually pick up the de some of the detour low sugar protein bars while I was in the store too so I will be reviewing that one in the coming future and if that video has actually been released then you'll be able to see it by clicking in this link here in the meantime guys though give this video a like you know what to do help us all out give this video a like leave me a comment down below if you have tried these bars and what you thought of them and if you haven't already then don't forget to smash that subscribe button and ring that bell to stay up to date with all the latest notifications from this channel now to see more video reviews click on this link here and to see the latest content from this channel click on this link here and i'll see you on that next one